he left us to go get educated. So you can do more stuff for us. That's or, what I tell myself. Or leave us forever. No, no, no. He's going to give up the gaming gig. I just know it. <laughs> right. He's going to come work for us for $10,000 a year. Right. And, and then, and he's going to give up that six-digit mm -hmm. lifestyle that he potentially has coming. So, what have you been doing this week, Heather? Oh, uh, all the things. It's summer. Tell Shelly. Shelly's texting you again. Uh-huh. Tell Shelly we're live. We're live. <laughs> Non-rabbit and we're live. Non We've been doing rabbit. a lot of rabbit club planning stuff. We're almost done with all that. Because Oregon Flock and Fiber is coming up, which is in Canby, Oregon. It's one of our biggest events. Mm -hmm. We, as a lot of you know, we are board members of the Northwest Angora Rabbit Association. And we um, we have a barn at Oregon Flock and Fiber full of bunnies mm -hmm. and vendors. And, and all sorts of fun, crazy things. So the yarn shop is there with all of our specialty blend robing and yarn and then our um yeah yeah and bunny and our bunny show and lots of education and it's a busy weekend so we've been doing a lot of that yeah exactly. so we've been doing a lot of that and then it's labor day weekend coming up yep which is our end of summer shop party. Right. Beach party on the lanai. Yes. We we learned what a lanai was. We did. We did a study on that. It was really in depth with Wikipedia helped us a lot. Yeah, a lot. Uh huh. So the a lanai is a concrete patio with a it's what a patio is that is fancier. Like if you live in Florida or it's Hawaii, it's called Lanai. So we decide we live in the tropics. So it's a Lanai now, not a patio. So come join us. Right. On our Lanai, we have our friend Amy. Amy. I remember the name. Thank you, because it was only escaped me. With Lula Row, because we needed more clothes, it was either that or wash clothes. When you just don't have time to wash clothes. Well, yeah, right. So, so you guys come down and see Lula Row, which is really fun. And also, we are having an in-shop sale. Yeah. And it's a graduated sale for the morning sun, the morning mm -hmm. save. So if you guys want to get sweater for, um, I almost say Christmas, for the winter thing that's coming up, there's a season called winter. Or if you really do feel the need to make somebody a Christmas sweater, I request mine with a llama, but the llama must be wearing antlers and a sparkle nose. Have one a lot like that? That was a hat. That was a hat. <laughs> yeah. A hat. <laughs> a hat. And a scarf. Okay. He didn't say it was a it was I a think, fake antler. I and think that like a, like a Christmas sweater with, with like you know how they used to have the reindeer wrap? If it had llamas around, that would be really fun. Ooh, in Fair Isle? Yeah, like a Fair Isle llama. Can the llamas be wearing antlers? No, yeah, they look like reindeer. That would totally pull the whole point. <laughs> I guess we could get a reindeer one and be like, no, no, they're llamas wearing antlers. <laughs> yeah, that's what mine would look like. That would be like, it would be like, fat you know, reindeer. Fat with fat right. legs, puppy fluffy fat, fat, fat legs. Like yep. Fluffy reindeer. <laughs> They'd be like, what the heck happened to your reindeer? Cookies? <laughs> And those are fake antlers, which makes it enough. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm trying to get our video up so I can see if people are talking to us. You haven't been an adult. I'm, I'm trying to adult. I thought it was your month to adult. Did we have this conversation? Well, I'm the one who, my phone is the live phone right now. Because and hers is more chargy. Because it plugs in. Um, I set it up a long time ago. Right, right. Oh, I hear I got it. Now I can see too many talk. Do we have volume at all? I yeah, yeah. Oh. If I turn this up, I heard us. Oh, good, good. And now I turn it off so that I don't hear us in stereo. <laughs> That's really <laughs> bad. I'm like 40 seconds behind the delay. Great. <laughs> it's like the Facebook must make sure we're not doing anything nefarious. Right. 
So along with our sale, uh -huh. we have a sale. We have a sale, and the sale is to the time because it is Afghan season. It's probably all. Oh, 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 we have. I have it. I have it. Oh, ready? Wow! Oh, you're so. I just almost. Hey, Terry. Right, right, guys. <laughs> Look at Danielle after a year. It's finally almost like unkitted. Unkitted. That's the word. What do you mean by unkitted? Like your mom brain is going away. No. Yeah, it is. It's been really good. Oh, I got to tell you guys. So last <laughs> week, a week ago, last week. It was Tuesday, wasn't it? Didn't I take Tuesday? Did I take Tuesday? Yeah. No, it was last Monday. Tuesday. Was it Tuesday? It was Tuesday. You were not here on Tuesday. No, it was Monday, and then Tuesday we took the crap down to the fairground. Right. Not wool. Okay. Last Monday, okay, we signed on our house. Yay! So as of last Tuesday, we were homeowners. Mm -hmm. Not Heather and I, but Heather, but myself and my husband. <laughs> right, we're homeowners. We own a trailer and a house right. now together. <laughs> we <laughs> own it. Yeah, we own these things <laughs> separately. It's really awesome. Uh -huh. So, um, this is why it's not unkitted yet. And all delightful homeownership. One of those boys broke a window yesterday. A big window. Not, just not like not, not a dollars Or like the paint on the door or something. Window. No, no, no. The giant seven foot by four foot picture window. Mm -hmm. That hurt. Um, at least they waited until after we purchased it. Not while we were renting for the last six years. <laughs> right? So anyway... We're going to, I don't know, fix that by buying more yarn or something. I don't know. That makes it feel better, right? Right. Because we're going to need afghans. Because it's going to be a little drafty until we can get that window fixed when finally a window company can come out and fix it in November. Because we were told that there is a rash of window breaking. <laughs> right? <laughs> they're out until November. <laughs> What's to say? Our last week of summer has not been easy. Neither has a lot of people. <laughs> right. So, on that note, Noro, we got the new Noro blankets in. Blanket books in. Are you scared to see that? Yeah. 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 Well, I can't tell for sure, but I don't. So, so yes. timeless Noro knitted blanket. They're really cool. They're all knitted by the way. Not that we would have looked for them. Not that we would have looked through this for the crochet pattern. Nope, never. <laughs> Just because it says knitted. Knit. <laughs> on knitted. the thing. But they're really pretty. And knitted blankets are really squishy. <clears throat> I don't know if you can see this one. This one's gorgeous. I love this that's one. That's the heart one? Nope. Oh, the leaf one? Yeah, that one's really Okay, pretty. so that one. This one. I picked out the yarn for it. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it's called. Oh, it calls for Silk Garden. I say nope. 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 I would do it in tenon. This is our new tenon. The tenon amazing. is amazing. It is wool, silk, and alpaca. Super squishy. Super squishy. It's $25 for 250 meters, which okay. is like 275 yards. Yeah, and then I would do the colored leaves. Colored leaves and a rainbow. In this, you know. in the Edo. The Edo is wool, and it is 400 meters, so like, this is like practically a blanket in itself right it here. It like a tree. It would look like fall. Right, like a fall tree. Perfectly fall tree. Fall so there you go. Tree. That's what I would do. That one in. And all the others. What, let that me Edo. see that pattern. Let me see. Uh, let me, I'm going to tell them how many they would need. Okay, I'm going to adult this really goodly. Whoa. Let's find a pattern. Let's find a Maybe I brought it's it. It's like in the middle. Right. 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 Okay, well, we're going to Okay, okay, okay. I'm just going to smell So this calls for 15 skeins of Nora of Silk Garden. Silk Garden's only 100 meters. That's 100 meters. So it's seven, ten. Would, would and you is that in two colors? Nope, just one color. There's two 
Toll, ich bin mal eh fast gern. Ja, das ist das ist voll das ist voll das ist voll der Metal. The Metal and it's ending out the light. A Norosco Garden in 267 Hope Black. Okay. That covers the outside leaves too. It's not a huge blanket. So seven. You'd have seven of these. Yep. And then eight skeins of red rust. So that would be two of those. So you're looking at you know same the same, same price, but either way you do it. But Right, but I just you know, because all Noro is actually everybody comes in, oh, I heard Noro's really expensive. Because twenty years ago they saw it in a yarn shop and they thought it was really expensive because it was the first time they went to a this is my own personal theory. The first time they ever went to a yarn shop and they never looked at really good quality yarn before. In reality, Noro is either ten dollars per hundred grams or twelve dollars per hundred grams. Mm -hmm. Depending on whether or not it has silk in it. They keep it really consistent. Right. Like seriously, it's, this is two hundred this is a hundred grams and it's twenty five dollars. But it has alpaca. Or ten dollars for fifty grams, I'm sorry. Yeah, fifty grams. And this has silk and alpaca in it. Right. So, so you have two hundred and fifty meters, that's two seventy five yards ish. Mm -hmm. Of this, and it's I don't know worsted-ish. Yeah, it's a heavy worsted, I would say. It's it would be very pretty. So, but they're gorgeous, and I want it, but I'm not knitting a blanket. But even though I'm not knitting a blanket, I am crocheting a blanket. Right there, because that's our pet, and it's over there. Here is our ongoing Nora blanket. It is a sampler. You can come into the shop and see it. This is the wrong side. This is the right side. Oh, uh, no, Mom took care of me. Mom, you just leave it in. So I leave my work here and Mom's just looking at me. Heather's still looking at pattern. So I'm I'm now on to the Mirai, which is 100% cotton. I can create a little squares out of that. It's pretty. So... Well, this is the one. This is Shadow Angles, and that's done in the tenon, along with their Fujisawa, which is like a seventy one, like alpaca, which we don't have. No, okay. because as much as I'd like to get all the Noro, if you guys could supply more yarn, then I can get more Noro. When we own a bigger building, when we own this bigger building, no. we're not moving ever, never. When we own the whole building, and we take out the walls, and we have yarn, yeah. When we have yarn, floor to ceiling. You know when you think about we spit a lot more yarn in here. Library ladder. Right. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe if we did it on this wall though, and if we could like reenact like Beauty and the Beast. Oh, so you have to have a thing that comes up. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, like a curve. Yeah. To the beat of like that might make it? changing the light bulbs easier too. <laughs> it might. <laughs> nah. If not, it would be a lot more fun anyway. Nah. Okay, so then <laughs> Also, in cold weather, <laughs> our fall. And, reminder, look, I, I balled my yarn. Heather said I can't start. Nope. Yet. She keeps yelling at me and saying no. She keeps using that word. I don't think she knows what it means. She's using it the wrong way. Her brain's in. It's like mm -hmm. startitis. Startitis. What's that? Oh, Startitis, not Startitis. That's a great name. Let's do a rabbit. What about our imaginary kids? <gasps> no, that's Night Fury. That's Night Fury. We have an imaginary child. <laughs> we have an Dorian. They turned into a hurricane. <laughs> we can never name a baby Dorian. Nope. Or a dog. Or Dorian. <laughs> no, nope. Dorian and Dorian. Nope. <clears throat> mm -hmm. so, okay. So, starting September 1st. Yep, four weeks off along. Yep. Um, but by the crocheter. Yeah. So no. she's never made socks. This we can do it badly it. together. No. <laughs> really, socks are not hard. No, they are. They're they're an exercise in feet. I've made a pair, which means two whole socks. Mm -hmm. Not at the same time either. So, and and they were the same size. Mm -hmm. And everything. They so if I can do it. I didn't get them. They were like half a size too small. It was just the worst ever. I had to get them. So this time, we're going to try again. <laughs> <laughs> so I have my yarn, and it's really pretty. We also have, we have all, all the pirate dyed yarn.
corn. Okay. Which we're starting to say all of this weekend. Right. We have two copies of this book in stock. So if you want to come and snatch it up, not only does it have the pattern we're going to be using, which is the Caribbean socks, dreaming of the Caribbean toe up, because I'm hoping with a toe up I can get the sizing right for my feet. We did this in college. Mm -hmm. Because supposedly you can try them on, on as you go. That way. Also, did you know that the tip of your finger should be on here if you step side your hand of your, of your hand? <laughs> Like you stick your fingers in the Yep, salt. and you can know how you are if you go along. Right. We're going to try really that. Cool. And I had a whole bunch of people test that theory for me because I saw it on the internet, so then I had to have them test it. Is there another one about how, like, your foot is as long from here to, to here, here? Yeah. And like your that. nose is exactly to the point? <laughs> There's a whole bunch of them. There's a whole bunch of them. And, like, the width of your eye is the same to this, is the same Balance to this. Balance is amazing. Balance is amazing. Our bodies are very symmetrical in everything, generally, within reason. Plus, you're a model. That's why the models do because they're just slightly out of balance and they catch your eye. Like the major runway models. Or they're extremely balanced. Mm, they're almost the opposite. So, slightly out of balance. They're taller than they should be. They are. Like they're, yeah. Anyway. They're all tall. Okay, so. That's coming from somebody who's not short. Mm -hmm. So socks, we'll be starting that in Janu January, <laughs> not in January, on the 1st of September. <laughs> that's like January. That's still like January. That's after the kids go back to school. No, yeah. in yeah. January, this is, they go back to school too after Christmas. Right. That's a long time for Bill. I hope to have oh. new windows by then. <laughs>
which according to the child bounced off the couch and into the window. I don't believe it. I think he was angry. But I wasn't there. I'm going to give them the benefit of the doubt. We're, we're going to, before they were placed, when they actually have a window, <laughs> when they actually have a window figured out, okay? This is and we have the couch do. move. Because you, this is a plate glass window. There's no saving any part of this window. Let me no, this, first say that. No, no, this window's toast. The whole window's gone. So I want to move the couch, put cushions there, like, like ones we could throw away, and put plastic up the glass. And I want to see if we can reenact and get the thing to bounce in the um, window like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, we should. We should put our car down and we should... Right, because I think it'd yeah. be really fun. I also kind of like breaking things. But I <laughs> we can see. It could be really fun because they've already moved the window anyway. Right? <laughs> so, why not have some fun while they, before they do it and see oh exactly gosh. how oh. hard it is to break a, dog, a, a window with the dog bone bouncing off of a cushion. I don't know why the heart 
So we got these earlier this year. This is the Geshi and new colors of the Curie Patora. More Curia Patora. Edo. The Edo is amazing. Always more um, Curion. We got more Silk Gardenin. This is the tenon. The tenon is amazing. It's fat. Work up really fast. Um, lots of really lovely neutral colors. Make a great sweater, cardigan, something of that nature. We got more of the Kayo in. And we have Kiri. And Akari. So, and then here we'll go over here. That is our classic wool. And we have the Ella Ray Cozy Soft. It's one of our staples. I think most of you guys have seen this. But we got more Rainbow Beach in. We talked about that earlier, but we got more because, as always, we always have to have more. Look at that green, Shelly. It begs to be yours. And then, like, red. Um, your favorite pattern is the one I do for you, huh? That could be scary, Shelly. So, those are the new colors of the Rainbow Beach that we just got in, guys. And so, let me I'll walk kind of fast. Hopefully not so fast that it makes you taste dizzy. Hello, welcome. And then we have the Nunya. We got all of this in here just recently, and it's so yummy. And it's rainbow. It's pretty. It would be perfect carry along with the El Rey Silky Kid. <clears throat> and we have these great mini kits. Comes with a knit pattern for this shawl. If you are a non-knitter, I have a crochet pattern for you. So, and then we have a few more new ones that just came in. We got all the Perth in. It has been a really busy yarn. Um, people are loving it. It's going quickly. Look at these stripes. And it's so stretchy. So look at all these colors we have. New fun game I play with the kids is, is what color socks do you think your brothers would like? So, and then we have Husko sock. We did an unboxing of this kind of sort of and was like, look at all the colors. It was amazing. And then over here, we have Katmandu, which New just Katmandu. just came in. This one just came in. That green, maybe? Oh, green and brown is so pretty together. The green and brown. We that just like got my, this taupe in the beige. That's brand my new. favorite. That is, like, such a good sweater yarn. Oh, it's amazing. So, yeah, I, I love this apple green. Right. So, those are new. And then we come down here, and the Perth. Perth is new. I mean, Brisbane. Brisbane, sorry. Another United Yarn. Um, they have it as a bulky. I don't quite call it a bulky. Um, sometimes these labels are a little confusing. But there you go. 
and it is super awesome. Um, it is, what is this? It's super wash. So, totally sweater or cardigan or something really fun there. And then we got Drover in. <clears throat> this is a great yarn. It's a light size three. Put that in the camera. Drover's awesome. Um, Tweety Merino. And it has some great colors. We have a great chocolate brown, charcoal, like a plum, oatmeal, dark green. I don't know if I can get that dark green. Yep, there it is. Navy blue and brick red. So those are fun. And we got in some more Queensland United for some. So if you're you snag one before or they're all gone, one of those makes this great to big wrap. And we have the pattern for it. So we have a few more. We have blue and pink and gray and greens. So I'm trying to think, is there anything else I missed, I Heather? That's all. Oh. That's like all of our yarns. All the beautiful things. So this so, weekend. And a wall of Noro. Right. So this weekend. This oh, weekend. Hi. 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 So, yeah. Hi. So this weekend we are going to do the graduated sale. That is Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It is not going to go on Monday. Nope. Because Monday I have somebody else working here and it's too much work for her to do a sale. Um, it is going to be a graduated sale. Fifty dollars, you get five percent off. Goes all the way up to there, over two hundred dollars, you get a whole big thing. Ooh. Plus, it's the last weekend of slow crawl. Yes. So if you are slow crawling, as wobbly. Sorry, I got slow like a crawl. cramp in my finger. Slow crawling. Yes, we have that, and it's your last chance to get in our in-shop drawing, uh, which we have huge, amazing, fun stuff that we will ship mm -hmm. for free. Um, it's also the last chance to finish your regions or finish the whole thing. Um. And that is going on through Monday. So it's a big weekend in the shop. We also, like I say, we have LuLaRoe on the lanai. Oh, that's cute. And a party. We're going to have cupcakes. We're going to have a party. We might have punch. I don't know. We were debating. A lot of sugar drinks. Like, make my eye twitch. No. Probably not. No. Probably not. Cupcakes. No. You put cupcakes. Cupcakes. Mini cookies. Cupcakes. So you don't, they don't even count as calories. They're nope. Cookies. The mini. Yeah. Minis don't Five count mini cookies. Like eating a real cupcake. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. So um, we'll be doing that, and then you guys can see all the new yarns and be set up in for person fall and meetings. squish. So you guys can make blankets and socks right. and sweaters too. There is a chance that I might even have some new curly shell hand dye come in. I have 20 skeins of a super luxury one with like alpaca cashmere Ooh. silk at my house. It's just came in that I have to dye. Those would be very, very special. Very, very like amazing. It's got such a nice handle on that yarn. Danielle hasn't even seen it yet. I I'm haven't. I don't get to see it until it's like it's dyed. dyed. Yep. Right. So we have all that stuff coming on. If you have any questions, let us know. Or if there's something that you want to see us talking about that might be just last. Oh, 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 one last thing. What? In the next two weeks, we'll be like, I don't know, getting our hair redone. Yeah. Before Black Sheep and Black Oregon <laughs> Flock and <laughs> Fiber. Oregon Flock and Fiber. Uh huh. Three weeks. Right. So if you guys have any suggestions for our hair, let us know. Yeah. We're always I'm looking for ideas. We're doing something crazy. So let me know if you see something. Okay. Danielle might do something crazy too. Here, Danielle, show them you. I don't you know. It's really kind of boring right it, now. Right now it's boring. I mean, it's like even laying down. Guys, I was I know. here one day with a whole horn. Like, it was sticking up over here. I had a horn. Uh-huh. Are you doing <laughs> face shop things? No, I should be. No, I was like, oh, there's the magic effects button. No, Look. you don't need magic effects. <laughs> yeah, no, I was actually being an adult and looking <laughs> at the comments. Oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. No, there's a whole horn. It's okay. It's, you know, horns can happen. Mm -hmm. So, all right, we'll see you guys next time. Yeah. And let us know, like I say, if you there's something that you want to see or talk about or a technique you want to learn because free sharing of information is what we do. Yes. I can't get out of the thing now. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh, your there we go. Your phone's going to shoot, guys. It's There's the rainbow. We'll end on the rainbow.